What's going on everybody? Super Saiyan Paul here back at it again. Today we got a leaked image like we predicted of Dragon Ball Super episode 131. Now this has been confirmed from Yanku Productions from Twitter and he's a very reliable source and apparently you can even find this on the FujiTV.co.japan animation website so if you guys go there there's gonna be a link i found it off of his twitter and he also is claiming that this is a real photo of what's going to be happening in dragon ball super episode 131 now the thing here is that both goku and frieza are here side by side and even though it, it, the spoiler said something else it leads to question what exactly is going on here because the spoilers it made it seem as though Goku and Frieza can't be together at one time on screen until after Frieza reveals himself but at that point the spoilers also told us that Goku was supposed to have gotten ringed out. So what do you guys think is going on? What has happened in the tournament of power and in Dragon Ball Super episode 131 what is this actually trying to say to us because from first glance it seems as though Goku and Freeze are about to rush Jiren or something like that like maybe it's a battle cry type of thing or if you want to delve further into it Jiren could possibly win and he's about to get the wish and he wished for something devastating which would, this would be the reaction I wouldn't expect it from Freeze. this is the reaction I would expect from everyone else in every other universe if Frieza got the wish but even Frieza looks like he's amped up and he's ready to take on Jiren however the spoilers that we got that were revealed to us via Herms 98 they've always been true and they've all added up however they don't make sense in this occasion because this picture it just doesn't make sense comparing to what we've seen on the spoilers now a few things about this this could potentially be after they win the tournament and maybe they're looking at Xeno or something like that it's not necessarily in the midst of battle but what this image does give away is that mastered ultra instinct is going to burn out and the main reason why is because he has no much no more stamina and one of the things about ultra instinct that was kind of ironic was that he had to master like his, his ability to control and everything and then after mastering it he's still gonna burn out because the dude's been fighting for so long he has no energy left and after everything he's been through like even though it's been plot armor up until this point where he's been pulling out all of this power plot armor instinct is going to run out and it's gonna fail against Jiren and and most likely this is probably if you put those things together if this is after it fails against Jiren what exactly does this mean are they both benched on the sidelines or is this after Jiren is defeated or if Jiren defeats them tell me what you guys think in the comment section below but clearly Goku has ran out of mastered ultra instinct Goku cannot take on Jiren at this point if anything unless Jiren has been weakened down to that level where he just can't like keep up with anything and just it's a base form Goku could take him on but I put 131 most likely halfway through Goku is going to either get ringed out but for the most part it's it's basically 100% confirmed here in this image alone that yo Goku is no longer going to have mastered ultra instinct in his ability now what this reminded me of was remember back in Dragon Ball GT back in the day guys when Goku was fighting on the dragons and I believe he was about to fight Nova or Ice Shenron and the dude was hungry like this guy was hungrier than anything and remember how his stamina was just like that drained after every battle this was one of the things I did not like about GT more than anything the dude was never fighting at 100% because he was so hungry all the time and it was just battle after battle after battle and it's almost the same type of thing here where it's not necessarily focusing on the hungry part but he's been beaten down so many times and just coming back with zero energy and then the plot armor instinct takes over and here it goes again failing when they need it the most what do you guys think about that do you guys think it's interesting do you guys like what's going on here now a lot of people have been outraged at what we've seen from the spoilers thus far and this image could be read in any like different way because a picture is worth like a million or a thousand words in, in like the context right so with that being said all of these things together when you put them side by side to the spoilers they might have actually try to pull a fast one on us by releasing this image or leaking this image maybe even on purpose just to spew out some more hype because with this you speculate on so many things that come to mind and they don't necessarily add up to the spoilers the reliable spoilers that have been right like through thick and thin up until this very date that it just doesn't make sense but all the spoilers that have been released so far even from the Korean text and the Japanese text they make sense they add up they fit together but this image just brings out so many questions so I want you guys to tell me what you guys think in the comment section below do you think Jiren will win and get his wish do you think 
Frieza and Goku are going in for one final attack, which is opposing the spoilers because Goku's supposed to be ringed out at this point. And if you guys want a rundown of what's supposed to happen in the spoilers, here we go because I made a video with Unreal Timmy Gaming breaking this down. Actually, you guys might want to go check it out. According to the spoilers, episode 130, Goku and Jiren are going to be fighting head on for basically the entire episode. We don't know if anything else is going to be featured, but we do know is Frieza is going to be hidden, just like he was hidden throughout these past few episodes as well. And they're going to keep hiding him until 131. But 130, a very, very climactic battle right there. It's going to be a lot of back and forth and maybe some more... Um, Jiren character development or some more smirks that you saw like when he was grinning in episode 129 and things of that nature that will reveal to us more of Jiren's personality. Now besides that in 131 we know that 30 seconds of the fight is going to be remaining because in episode 130 from that starting point it's a minute and 30 seconds left in the in show time and then moving onwards into 131. What's supposed to happen according to the Korean and Japanese spoilers that have been leaked and according to Herm's 90 Herms, he basically said, and, and remember, he's a lot reliable source, that Frieza is supposed to jump in after Goku and Jiren have their showdown. What's supposed to happen here is that Goku and Jiren are going to fight to the point where Goku is going to get ringed out and fall off of the stage. But even though he falls off of the stage, there's going to be a moment or brief second where Jiren and Goku both are looking at the Omni King like the fight's supposed to end. And in that moment is when Freeze is going to death beam Jiren. And right then and there, that's where it's going to be a question mark as to what's going to happen here. Because Jiren's going to be weakened. We know this for sure. The guy is battle damaged in the preview in episode 130. So taking that even further to the point where Goku is being even exhausted from Master U Ultra Instinct UI. It kind of redeems the fact that you mastered, Ultra mastered Ultra Instinct isn't necessarily going to be used at its fullest here. Because if it runs out... It doesn't necessarily mean the form is like weaker than Jiren. It just means that Goku's just too tired to carry it on and that Mastered Ultra Instinct still could surpass Jiren in terms of power scaling and still could even be indebatable for the other gods. So Mastered Ultra Instinct isn't te technically taking a nerf and it kind of saves the form because if you think about it, when you think about Mastered Ultra Instinct and its debut, everyone's like, wow, it's getting defeated right away as soon as they bring it in here. And it was kind of similar to what they did with Super Saiyan 3 with how it's draining a lot of stamina and he just doesn't have enough to keep it going and it's not going to get the ultimate decisive victory here. So it's kind of like the same formula being replicated in a way and, and similar to some of that of GT where he was just too tired to carry on the fight or, or he's just tired all the time. And that's where I see it like it was battle after battle after battle and those constants are being, being brought in here. But... This image with Goku and Frieza side by side, where do you guys think this is taking place? Is this right after the tournament's over? Is this when they're getting the wish? Is this when Jiren does something unexpected? What do you think happens after everything's done and over with? Because if you think about it, this leaked image has to take place after Jiren and Goku have their spout. And I'm thinking this has to be towards the ending of the episode, if anything, right before the wish. Because Jiren's probably going to do something revolutionary, and I think Jiren's still going to lose. And my predictions, comparing this to the spoilers, Jiren's still set up to lose based on the evidence that was given to us. Now, remember, they could always pull a fast one us technically with the spoilers, but I don't think they've ever done that in history. And for them to do that would be completely out of character for the show. So I still say Jiren's going to get eliminated by Frieza. And then after his defeat, he's going to probably do something very, 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 very interesting on screen. And remember, it's going to be a very interesting title for 131 as well. A miraculous conclusion for well, Goku, until we meet again, we don't necessarily know what Jiren's gonna do. And honestly, like I, I would just throw things out there. What if he pulls what Hit did? Like, like he's just like, okay, I finally found a fighter that can match up to me, and he does something like Seppuku, or what if like he just decides that you know what? Uh, he has to do something that catches our attention. What do you guys think that would be in the comments? Because it's just really interesting to speculate on that. But this picture has to have, like fall in within like maybe the last ten minutes of the show. So. Very interesting news information updates here. Make sure you guys smash that like button. Make sure you guys subscribe. Make sure you guys turn on notifications to be updated on all information on the episodes as well as leaked images, spoilers, and more breakdown as to what's going to be happening as well as discussions with other YouTubers such as All Unreal Entertainment Gaming and we'll be talking about more about the movie and gameplay coming out soon. So thank you guys yet again. I appreciate all of your support. I'll be seeing you guys next time. Take care. Peace.